Greetings and salutations. My name is Melita Wilson, and I'm the director for Fraternity and Sorority Life here at Southern Miss. Fraternities and sororities are social organizations formed to help students grow into better men and women. At Southern Miss, our 26 fraternities are governed by three councils, the Inner Fraternity Council, National Panhellenic Council, and the College Panhellenic Council. The Office of Fraternity and Sorority Life supports our members and leaders to function autonomously while promoting the mission of their organizations as well as that of the university. What can membership offer? There are four guiding principles of fraternity and sorority life at USM. The first is scholastics. Members have access to academic resources, which include tutors, academic advisors, and study groups. Members are often rewarded through scholarships and awards for their efforts. The next pillar in our community is relationships. As brothers and sisters, members embrace their diverse ideals and beliefs as they are emotionally invested in the other's physical and emotional well-being. Our next pillar is leadership. Members actively practice values-based leadership in their own chapters and are some of the highly, highest engaged members in other organizations on campus. The last pillar is service and citizenship. Members participate in community service opportunities on and off campus while advocating for social issues facing their communities. Each council executive board has a president who will introduce their council. First, let's meet Ramsey Thrasher. Ramsey serves as the president of the Interfraternity Council known as IFC. IFC is the governing body for local chapters of the national fraternity organizations specifically associated with the North American Interfraternity Council. The nine IFC fraternities on our campus are Alpha Ta Omega, Delta Ta Delta, Kappa Sigma, Phi Kappa Ta, Pi Kappa Alpha, Pi Kappa Phi, Sigma Alpha Epsilon, Sigma Nu, and Sigma Phi Epsilon. Now let's meet Taylor McDonald. Taylor serves as the president of the National Panhellenic Council known as NPHC. NPHC is the national coordinating body for the nine historically African-American fraternities and sororities also known as the Divine Nine. All nine NPHC organizations are currently active on campus. The sororities are Alpha Kappa Alpha, Delta Sigma Theta, Zeta Phi Beta, and Sigma Gamma Rho. The fraternities are Alpha Phi Alpha, Kappa Alpha Psi, Omega Psi Phi, Phi Beta Sigma, and Iota Phi Theta.
Last, but certainly not least, let's meet Julia Bishop. Julia serves as the president of the College Panhellenic Council, known as CPC. CPC at Southern Miss is the governing body for the eight national Panhellenic Conference sororities on campus. CPC is responsible for setting all policies and regulations that concern our sorority community. CPC coordinates events on campus, includes educational programs, speakers, community service projects, and primary recruitment. The eight CPC sororities on our campus are Alpha Delta Pi, Alpha Chi Omega, Chi Omega, Delta Delta Delta, Delta Gamma, Kappa Delta, Phi Mu, and Pi Beta Phi. Most men choose to join during the fall through our structured recruitment in early August. At their discretion, individual chapters are recruit throughout the early half of each semester. Men enrolled at Southern Miss are eligible. So, how to join MPHC? First, you are required to have at least 12 USM credit hours um, just to be eligible. Then after that, the MPHC will be hosting two MPHC informationals. The first one will take place on August 16th, 2020, and the second one will take place on August 30th, and it will serve as a makeup MPHC informational for anyone who didn't get the opportunity to attend the first one. After that, each individual chapter will host an interest meeting um, if they are intending to bring out a new a group of new members for the upcoming semester. As far as joining the College Panel and the Council, most women choose to join through primary recruitment in early August. Primary recruitment is highly structured and all chapters participate. Eligible chapters can continue to recruit throughout the semesters, but will mostly concentrate their efforts early in the semester. Women enrolled at Southern Miss are eligible to participate. Joining any organization requires commitments of time, money, academic achievement, service to your community, and for many chapters residing in on-campus housing. Each chapter will at a minimum host a chapter business meeting a week. Additionally, chapter members will be expected to participate in chapter events which vary from week to week. Chapters require member dues to operate and the costs vary significantly. Each chapter has initial one-time costs and dues per semester. CPC costs roughly $500 a semester, IFC $550 a semester, and MPHC varies from $100 to $300 a semester. Chapters each have a minimum GPA to join as well as maintain as a chapter member. Service hour agreements also vary by chapter, with some chapters hosting consistent service opportunities. House chapters will have a minimum live-in requirement ranging from two to five semesters. It is important to ask chapters about their obligations and confidently know the requirements of each chapter before committing to join. If you decided you're ready to find a home in one of our 26 fraternity and sorority chapters, please register your information using the following QR codes. Additionally, links are listed in the notes of this presentation. Don't forget to follow us on social media, Facebook at USM Fraternity and Sorority Life, Instagram and Twitter at USM underscore FSL, you may also email our Fraternity and Sorority Life office at fsl at usm.edu. If you would like to email a specific council, their email address is as follows, ifc at usm.edu, nphc at usm.edu, and cpc at usm.edu. Thank you for your interest in Fraternity and Sorority Life at Southern Miss.